Today we're going to be testing out the Dollar Shave Club double header. It's like a beard trimmer slash uh, I guess you can shave your face with it too. Looking at the attachments though, it comes with the, uh, here's the shaver. I'm actually going to shave my head. So if it passes a test with shaving my head, you know I can shave a beard. And then uh, it comes with a, a pretty nice bag to keep all your attachments and stuff in. The box that it comes in shaped nice for gift wrapping, yada yada. Um, it looks pretty nice. Um, where is... Oh, here's the attachment for the... Uh, looks like they almost copied the Phillips one blade, I want to say. Can't quite remember, but see how it does on your face. Pretty skeptical. Don't like these kind of razors for your face. But we're going to put it to the test. Alright, so this is the main trimmer attachment. All you do is push against it and it pops right off. Yeah, it pops right off. Just pop it right back on. It does look like it has a little some type of plastic guard like the, uh, oh, that body shaver. Can't remember what it's called, where you can shave downstairs if you're into that kind of stuff. But looks like they copied quite a few people. It does remind me of the Phillips One Blade a little bit. Anyways, I'm going with the the two millimeter attachment I usually use a one to shave my head but I don't see one so I'll just go over it again after the video but here we go let's see if this bad boy works Just need to adjust my little hair mat right here. Control the hair on the floor. Well, it looks like the hair is piling up, so there is a little brush that comes with it. We don't see a little brush. Oh yeah, there's one. I don't have time to open it for the video, so I'm just gonna use a Q-tip. You can just use a Q-tip if you have to. So you have to keep the hair cleaned out of it as you go. I don't feel like tugging up my hair at all yet, so see if it gets a clean shave. Might have to move the camera over by my bathroom also. Or by my bathroom mirror, I was going to say. It's doing a very good job for the size of trimmer that it is so far. Oh, cut there. Have to get it going pretty quick for it to catch your hair, so. As long as you just keep a slow, gentle stroke, it's really doing a good job. But, uh, I am going to have to get closer to the mirror. Okay, never mind. Start on this side, as long as you guys can see. really is doing a pretty good job, so. So I'm taking a little hair off with each stroke and it's not pulling out my hair. As long as I don't get going too fast, so. Pretty impressive for a little shaver. Go ahead and shave the front here so you can see.
All you have to do is hold it upside down and tap it and the hair falls right out for the most part. So, but I am pretty impressed so far. It's really getting the job done, not pulling out my hair or anything. So that's the main part for me when it comes to shaving is the comfort of the shave. So pretty much already went over my entire head pain free. So I did a pretty good job. I still need to go over it in the back. I don't want to torture you guys make you watch me shave though I'm going to switch over and shave my face with it all right here is the face shaver uh, just like the other one it pops off and on the only thing I don't like is this little spindle that's the driver uh, it is plastic it looks fairly cheap but who knows I'll jump online anyways and check the reviews but this pops right on it is flexible so that probably helps it doesn't go side to side but it does go forward and backwards so here we go I'll just shave half my face real quick and then check it in the mirror. Okay, I'm gonna have to switch over to the mirror real quick. Just trying to let you guys know that I'm actually using the product anyway, so. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and stop because I was skeptical as a face shaver anyway. It's getting a fairly close shave, but it's hard to get more than, like, uh, I don't want to say a 5 o'clock shadow with these type of razors, but um, it is a great trimmer for a bare trimmer if you're into that. And I would not use it as my primary face shaver, though. It just doesn't shave close enough. There's nothing to catch the excess here either, so you have to make sure you have something in place to catch the hair so um there's definitely better shavers out there overall i wouldn't buy it but i'll still jump online and compare prices